Hey, I'm Matt with PSI, and in this video we're going to talk about the differences between the Gen 3 and Gen 4 LS engines. Now the first thing you're going to notice when you walk up to a complete engine like this, if you have the intake manifold, is going to be the throttle body. This one here is drive-by cable, mechanical throttle body. That was only offered from GM on the Gen 3 engines. Also, the Gen 3 engines, whether they're drive-by cable or drive-by wire, are all three-bolt patterns, whereas the Gen 4s were only offered in drive-by wire, and they all have a four-bolt pattern. Now, the most important feature to distinguish the two is going to be, let me get the intake out of the way. The most important feature is going to be the crank sensor, which is going to be down here, right behind where your starter would be. Black is going to indicate that you have a Gen 3 24X engine, whereas gray will be a 58X Gen 4 engine. Also right in the, around the same area, if you have a 58X Gen 4 engine, you will have right in front of it a knock sensor and there will be one on that side and one on the other side of the block. Whereas a Gen 3 will have them up in the valley and the valley plate will have these two big holes where they mount in. In the valley also on a Gen 3 will be your cam sensor at the back. On Gen 4, let me move this out of the way. On Gen 4, your cam sensor is gonna be mounted on the front timing cover. Now this one here is non-VVT, as you can tell it's flat across here with just the cam sensor added into it. And over here, we have a VVT one. You can see there's a bump out here. Your cam sensor is still in the same spot, but you have this other two pin connector that controls your cam timing. Now, in between these two, you have the LS2 engines where they have a four bolt throttle body, they have the side knock sensors, but they could be a 24X, which is where you wanna make sure you check that to make sure the color of the crank sensor. Thanks for watching guys. Hope this video helped you get it wired up and fired up. Remember to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, drop a comment with any questions about this video or any ideas that you wanna see us cover in the future. And remember, you can always speak to a live team member at 732-276-8589 or at any one of the email addresses below. We'll see you guys in the next video.